So you guys, today's video is different because I owe you all a huge apology. So first off, let me say that I'm sorry for trying to lead people in the right way. So it's kind of tough for me to say, but it seems like the way YouTube is going, it's leading more towards misleading people, if that makes any sense. I feel that I've been trying to do the right thing by encouraging smaller YouTubers and to you know help them grow their channel and also you know just to tell people hey you know positivity spreads and you know just try to do the right thing and normally the right things come back to you maybe I'm misleading people you know so there's a lot of other youtubers out there that are growing their channel by misleading people by doing things that are out of their character and what I always felt was wrong. That's not the type of YouTuber I am. So that's why we started the whole, as you see behind me, the YouTuber of the Week series because we wanted to spotlight smaller YouTubers and trying to like bring their name to light, you know, bring their channel to a, 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 broader, a broader perspective. And um, I don't know if what we're doing is the right thing or it's not the right thing. I'm kind of hoping it is, but I don't know, you know. So, like I said, I, I wanted to get on here and I wanted to just apologize first off because, you know, I really, really thought spreading positivity and helping each other that would be the way that we would all grow. We would all be successful YouTubers. But I don't know. I don't know how true that is. So comment in the links below and let me know what do you guys think? Do you guys think that we should continue, you know, helping people or do you think we should be like the bigger YouTubers not help anybody? Because that's pretty much what they do. Bigger YouTubers help their friends and that's it you know they're they're fans and they're they're people that look up to them and everything you guys are the ones that that make them or break them you know you guys are the ones that created their channel created their lifestyle you see the youtubers with the flashy cars the big houses spending lots of money that's all because ad revenue because you watch their video. You know, and YouTube doesn't want you to know all the secrets. The bigger YouTubers know the secrets. They know the ins and outs because they've been through it. They were a small YouTuber once. So, like, you ever wonder why when you watch a video, you, the video is always 10 minutes or longer? Do you ever wonder why it's not shorter? If it's 10 minutes or longer, you, you normally get better ads. The longer time, you normally get better ads. That's kind of the way it works out, or it used to work out. I don't know about the newer, uh, the newer YouTube, how it works, but that's, that's it in a nutshell. If your video is 10 minutes or longer, you get better ads, you get a better CPM, you get a better ad rate. You know, if your video is short, you get short, you know, skip through ads that, you know, aren't very CPM friendly and, you know, that's just a little tip. And there's lots of little tips like that, that a lot of bigger, you, bigger YouTubers don't help you with. I mean, don't get me wrong. There's a lot of bigger YouTubers that are very helpful. Like, um, Jesse Ridgway, for example, McJuggernuggets is super helpful. He's put out many videos about 
you know, how, how YouTube works and how ad revenue works and how to grow your channel. He's, he is very, very transparent in what he does, which is amazing because normally big YouTubers, they, they feel that they had a grind to get where they're at. So you're going to have to grind to get where, to get where you're going, which is a good philosophy. But at the same time, if you don't help each other, you, you're just, you're creating havoc. People are stepping on top of each other to get where they got to be using clickbait and all kinds of crazy stuff that it's not needed. You know, it's, it's not. So, but there, there is, there is a few bigger YouTubers that are helpful, but the majority are not. They don't want to tell you how to grow your channel. They don't want to tell you, you know, how, like an MCN. Do you need one? Yes, no, maybe. You might not. You probably don't. Some cases it helps, depending on who your MCN is. Other cases it doesn't help. All they do is take a portion of your money and, you know, that's it. So... The, the YouTube game is very difficult, to say the least. You have to be yourself. You have to always try to do the right thing. And then you have to find your style, you know? And as you, as you progress and you learn your style, then you get to meet some pretty amazing people along your YouTube journey. And these people that you meet, don't forget about them. Embrace the time you have with them because one day they're going to be a bigger youtuber and they may forget about you Then again, they may not you don't know until it happens so like I'm saying, you know, I Want you guys You know to care for each other to look out for each other That's that's my thought. That's my thought process on this whole thing Am I going to be a big youtuber? Maybe not Maybe I will, but at least I know that I feel good myself about putting out videos that make sense. So this is my, um, my reason for my hiatus pretty much that I haven't been, I haven't posted a video in a couple days, you know, I'm a little bit off my schedule. I got, I got a whole lot going on. And um, this is a big part of it. So just so you guys know, you know, if, if your channel is not growing fast enough or if your, uh, your, your content is not getting the views that you want, I'm trying to help you do, to, do what I feel is the right thing by growing your community and growing your channel organically. If you want to, that's great. If you don't want to, on the other hand, and you want to go the other route and you want to clickbait people and you want to, you know, put all kinds of wild stuff and you want to make content that's not you, you know, like you want to jump around, you want to dab on everybody, that, that's fine. That's whatever your, your channel, that's the great thing about YouTube. YouTube is all about you. So with that being said, I love you all. Thank you guys for sitting down with me for a couple minutes and hearing me out you know i just i want the best for you and your channel so if you guys need any help i'm here for you if you don't need my help i'm still here for you you know so like i said thank you guys for everything that you do for me and my family each and every single day you guys created this channel without you i wouldn't be here Seems like